Well, at least I got it. Do I want to carry that the rest of the way, or...? Yeah, there's no way to get it to go through. Actually, no, that falls. Ah. Ah. Oh, I couldn't. I just barely couldn't reach it. It's trying to be quick. Jeez, I need to be even faster. Hmm. Alright, so... I bet I need to use the dash. Oh. Yes, yes I do. I have to jump first. Oh. No big deal. Ah. I feel like there needs to be a better tell. Like, right before it's about to stop. If I didn't mess that up, I could have just gone in for a second try. Too late. Oh god, oh no, oh... Okay, collected it, good. area to the side is back. Music change? Oh, I think I see what I need to do. Okay. Oh, damn it. Forgot that's not how you do it. Okay. Got the right idea, but I just need to execute it better. 
Yeah, I was gonna mess that up either way. Phew. Damn it. I need to stop letting go of right. Okay, apparently I need to let go of right for a bit there because I can actually outrun this thing. Time that wrong. So the fact that it pushes you off there isn't supposed to be a hint, it's just there. I see now. Oh god. Oh. Forgot about the wind. Didn't even need to dash there. If I would have pulled it off, I could just use the bubble to propel myself onto the thing. I didn't have the climb button held. Okay. What is that? Okay, they do kill you. Oh, didn't see those. Not gonna be able to get it from that ankle. There we go. Ooh. Oh, I can dash through those and I'll be fine. Oh. I don't want to hold up because that reduces how far I can go horizontally. Damn it. Dashing gets rid of them, but doing that doesn't. Oh my god, what was. Literally, what was I just saying about not doing it diagonally? Interesting, you can uh, use the dash button to get those to go faster. Ooh, just barely.
Oh god, should not have let go of that wall. Okay. Ooh, this looks fun. Now this is my style. Oh, that's not though. Ah, uh, really? Doesn't appear it's timed. It appears it's just when I get to that certain point. I need to do it straight down. This high speed area is really cool though. Oh, that's what I do. I don't go down and then up. I just go right, but not up. Oh. Whew. Gondola. Madeline, wait up. Jeez. How, how did you make it all the way up here with those two left feet? Nailed it. Theo, are you alright? Oh, yeah. Just give me a sec. A gondola. I've always wanted to ride one of these. It looks pretty old, but maybe it still works. I don't see any other way to cross this chasm. Let's do it. That's the spirit. You weren't all, let's do it, when we were talking about the hotel. This lever looks important. Easy every time. I was probably a gondola operator in a, pa in a past life. Do you think this thing is safe? I'm sure it's fine. Who was all, it's dangerous, come with me earlier? I ought to shake out with Oshiro. You were right. I shouldn't have tried to help him. I hate to say I told you so, but... Yeah, yeah. I should have listened to you. You didn't get hurt. That's what matters. The air is so thin up here. I can barely breathe. Okay, if we don't get a selfie on this thing, we're going to regret it. I can't even see the ground through the mist. How high up are we? Less panicking, more posing. What was that? Huh. Looks like we stalled out. This is really bad. Maybe if I... She's all like, nice gondola you've got here. Would be a shame if someone were to mess with it. Well, that's not good. No, this really isn't good. Madeline, you cool? Yeah, I just... No, I'm not cool. I can't breathe. You're having a panic attack. Why would you think it's a good idea to ride this stupid thing? Come on, don't take this out on me. Stay with me here. My grandpa taught me a trick for this. Close your eyes. Picture a feather floating in front of you. See it? Okay. Your breathing keeps that feather floating. Just breathe slow and steady. In and out. Oh, I actually have to press X.
the light button taps I'm having to do to keep this thing in the box probably aren't how you're supposed to breathe in real life. <laughs> See? Easy every time. Feeling any better? I think so. Thanks for helping me calm down. How'd you know we'd start moving again? Oh, I totally thought we were done for. Oh. My. God. Look at the selfie, though. Was it, like, right? Yeah, it was right when <laughs> it stopped. Well then. I can't overstate just how fun this game has been so far. Like seriously, uh... I've gone on and on about how it's challenging but not frustrating. And uh... The music is awesome. And I'm generally, like, excited for whenever I get to talk to somebody so I can do the voices again. This game is really cool. That's why I'm sad that I'll have to, uh, cut the session here, but I'll get to play it again some more in the future. So, what's with this heart thing? So, the red heart is side B, but the blue heart replaces it, and is not related to whether you be a level at all. If you get both, do you get a purple heart? <laughs> That'd be funny. I suppose with how hard it is to, uh, get those damn things, it would make sense. I'm gonna play this level again to see if I can get the blue heart on this one. Oh, that's really cool. So those signs on the walls are checkpoints. Not in the sense that you respawn there, because you respawn at the start of every room, but it tells you how many things are after it. That's really cool. There's somewhere over here, right? So do I actually need to get in there somehow and collect it here? Or is this just a visual thing and it's supposed to hit you to where you get that in Dream world or something? I'm gonna try going to that area in the dream world, I guess. There's no way up there without uh, activating the thing, though, so I guess I'll do that first. Oh, I can't even go down there from that way. I swear it's gotta be somewhere around here, right? There's all this stuff outside. I've tried breaking through that bit with ice, but... Doesn't appear to be the trick. There's all that stuff up there. Looks weirdly like a fortress or something. Okay, I just had to make sure there's nothing over there. Maybe it's up there. I don't remember ever going up there. Hey, strawberry. Cool. I am going to constantly be looking for ways outside. First of all, I got that. 
Okay, do I need to go down here then? It feels like it's going further away from my ultimate goal. Okay, so... Was I down there before? I don't think I was. Whoa, what's this? Wait, no, that's where I'm supposed to go, isn't it? This seems familiar. But no, wait, that leads up to there. So clearly you're supposed to, you're supposed to go down there and get something. And then come back up. Right? Only then it makes sense to me. I was about to land on that thing, and I was like, oh no, I'm not supposed to land on it. And you can't even get down there without doing that weird trick anyway, so that can't be the way that I went before. I have to have been this way before, right? What? That's bullshit. There's no way I could have known, known there would be a, no point, a point of no return there. Right, so it adds your deaths to the counter. Gotcha. Oh god, I have to watch all this again. Oh, that's convenient. What, so it's just alternate ways of getting to the same place? That is so weird. This weird secret, secret way leads to literally the exact same place, is harder, and misses a strawberry that the normal route has. There's a strawberry up there. So what the fuck? I only just found out that you can... You can dash straight on the ground and then jump and you'll preserve your own momentum. And actually, maybe that's what the uh, whole thing was about with the B-side. Like, that's just that same mechanic, but like you're dashing the whole time you're going through that. So weird. I, I just don't understand. So I guess the vulnerable in dreams thing wasn't actually a hint or unless it's somehow up here. I didn't get this before apparently. Wrong button. Lurking out of frame. An apparition not of this world. Does that mean the part of me or something? Because of it lurking out of frame. I really don't get it. I'm gonna go from the beginning one more time to see if I can figure out this fucking mystery. Hey, it's a uh, post commentary me here. Well, obviously because I'd have to be talking very slow and very deep for it to sound like this when the footage is going this fast. Uh, I tried and tried and tried to get the heart thingy, but I couldn't find it, and originally I was like, oh, maybe leave a tip or something, but no, I think I know where it is now. The one place I didn't look, I searched that entire goddamn level, and there was one place I didn't check. At least I'm pretty sure that's where it is. I thought of a place while I was editing, and I went in game to check it out. There's like three screens of build up to something, and I'm fairly certain it's the heart, but I just quit there because I wanted to collect it next time I play, so I'll explore that in the next session. But my god, the one place. The one place. Anyway, I'm very not in the mood to edit right now, but I realize I don't have anything to go up today, so maybe you're seeing this on the 27th. Maybe you're seeing it tomorrow if I can't get the video 
rendered in time for the regular upload time that I like to stick to. Either way, you can see sped up footage of my last attempt to try to look for the thing. As you can see, I tried literally everywhere else, trying to see if there was a place I could like break out into like the roof area to, you know, get where the thing would be. But nope, just editing Celeste and like reading comments on the Celeste videos and talking about it in my Discord that made me really want to play it again. But I know there are other series that people are looking forward to, so I guess I gotta do those first. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.